Next, we have Anu Thomas. She is a student in the Mendel Lab in the Genetics Development and Disease Program. She says she cannot handle horror movies. She watched The Conjuring with a bunch of friends in May and is still not over it. Her talk is entitled RBM33, a cellular postal service for RNAs with GC-rich regions. FedEx, UPS, USPS, Amazon. These are all package delivery services we're very familiar with. But have you ever wondered how molecules in your own body cells get precisely delivered, keeping you healthy and alive? Well, in my thesis project, I wanted to understand how this specific RNA molecule called NORAD gets precisely delivered from where it's made in the cells to where it performs its function. And this is an important question, because if NORAD is not delivered correctly, then the DNA in the cells don't behave properly. There's DNA damage, there's a change in chromosome number, and this is associated with several diseases, such as cancer. So essentially, I wanted to understand what the package delivery service for NORAD is. But we had no clue where to begin looking. So we decided to knock out every single gene in the human cell and ask in which case is the NORAD package delivery being affected. And in order to do this, we modified our cells so that they would glow green if the NORAD package was delivered correctly. And if the package was delivered incorrectly, this glow would be severely reduced. So basically, we ended up knocking out about 19,000 genes in the human cell, one after the other, and asked in which case is the cell's glow reducing. Through these experiments, we identified this gene called RBM33 that nobody had ever studied before as the gene responsible for delivering the NORAD package. And it turns out that RBM33 is more like the cell's own version of a FedEx or a UPS, because in addition to the NORAD package, it delivers hundreds of other RNA packages within the cell. But how does RBM33 know which the packages it needs to pick up for delivery? Turns out that these RNA packages come with their very own shipping labels, which are uniquely recognized by RBM33. And in this case, the shipping labels are rich in Gs and Cs, which are two of the four building blocks that make up an RNA package. And through the identification of this RBM33 delivery service, we now have an explanation for why over many, many years, scientists have observed that RNA packages with GC-rich regions are transported so efficiently in cells. But why should you care though, right? Well, guess what other RNA packages have shipping labels rich in Gs and Cs? Viruses, such as those that cause diseases like herpes, mono, Kaposi sarcoma, which is a type of cancer, are all known to be rich in Gs and Cs. So it's possible that when these viruses infect human cells, they may be able to hijack this RBM33 delivery service to now start delivering viral packages instead. And if that's true, we may be able to modulate RBM33 levels in cells to improve our immunity against these viruses. Thank you.